Look at that. Here comes the garbage can. Whoa! Yeah! <laughs> oh, it's over just so fast. <laughs>All right, welcome back to Armored Core 2. Let's, uh, we're gonna go in and make a big boy, big, big giant heavyweight, because we tried out the lightweight and it was kind of underwhelming. Um, let me know in the comments if you want me to head back to a lightweight. You, you know what, I will. I'm gonna come back to a lightweight, but I'm gonna do a floating type. I'll do that later. But let's build something big. All right, here's our build. Going for a super heavyweight here, and this is a super high defense core with a little bit of anti-missile. We've got some kind of average, just heavy, but nothing outlandishly special about these arms. Just good defense. And, uh, oh, these are the super heavy legs. They can carry a lot of weight and also have really high shell defense. Our internal stuff is the same. I was able to squeeze these relation missiles on by going with a smaller radar. And of course, here we go, finally bringing these large missiles. You get four shots, but each one does a massive 6,800 damage. So just flattens targets. Um, now I did have to go with a little bit of a smaller weapon here. I went with this rifle just to, so I could still take this thing on a mission. So I'll, maybe I'll give that a try. And then I'm gonna bring the moonlight. Uh, Yes, yeah, so let's go. Let's go and do the arena for a little bit, and we'll do a mission. Rank ten. The pilot name is number one 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 one. AC is count one. He's obsessed with the number one and has put a great deal of effort into his current position. He'd rather be ranked eleventh than first, as it has twice as many ones. And he's ranked ten. Oh, it's because we killed. Um, oh, why am I forgetting his name? Stink or something. no? It wasn't Stink. <laughs> I think it's. I, f uh, I forget what it is. Anyway, let's go beat him and get him down to rank 11 again. All right. Oh, he's got these energy. Here comes the big missile. Then with a couple little ones. Look at that trash can go. Oh, yeah. That's another one. This is why I'm not too concerned about a heavyweight being slow. Because... Get him! Yeah! <laughs> Win! Oh, look at this crazy guy. Look at that. Here comes the garbage can! Kadoosh! Still not as cool as those large missiles from. Oh, whoa! <laughs> from Project Phantasma and Mass Arena. Or have that blast radius the size of New York. Oh, boy! yeah! <laughs> All right, you're welcome. <laughs> oh, new mail. But for my arena ranking, I'm in the top 10 now. Congratulations on your advancement in the arena. Please accept this easy part of the game. We hope you're successful and continue. Blah, 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 blah. What did they give me? Ooh, prizes. What did I get? Not a head, not a core, not arms. It's usually a weapon if they're going to give you something. It's not legs. You can see I do still have my lightweight parts. So I do still have that build functional. For the quantum. Oh, it's an inside part. ECM to disrupt enemy locks. That's pretty good. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't really think I need it. Let's go try a mission with this ridiculous thing. Recover stolen files. Crystal Zeo Matrix. The files stolen by the special forces have been relocated to Belena Corporation's AC Research Lab. They must be recovered. This mission has two objectives. Recover the files and destroy the research lab. Okay, all right. Your area of responsibility is the removal of enemy resistance and planting Didn't bomb. let her read that last part. Oh, While well. While we're doing that, our team will work to recover the files. 
The bomb is to be placed on the facility's main computer. You must evacuate as soon as the bomb is sent. Okay, I can do that. You can gain access to the facility from either of two routes. Good luck. Hmm, 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 hmm. bomb and escape. Two routes. Probably want to choose a route that has more direct overboosty type. We arrived at the target area. Ads. Commencing AC drop. Well, they're putting me right in front of this one, but. Whee! Oh, great. Oh, is this it right here? It's like a pit that you can go in. Well, which way are we going? Oh, am I looking at it upside down? There we go. Yeah, let's go this way. Whee! You can gain access here. Avoid any security. Oh, is it a vent? Are they gonna destroy it? This feels kind of cool. Well, how do I avoid it? There's like laser beams so I have to shoot it I, I think does it hurt oh it hurts You've been detected they're transmitting ERL signals to the outside it's still a cool way to go in hey yeah, which way is my target slightly to the right oh and there's a uh, another Way in and out. That might be a good way to get through. Oh, hello. Was there another one, or did I get him with my laser blade? I guess I got him with the backswing. Okay, looks like going this way. Oh. Maybe? Do I, do I need to go down? Or is this going up? That's going up. Okay. Don't need that. I do want to go this way. Hmm. Whoa. <laughs> Shooting at me. Whoa. Some kind of a mine. Oh. Yeah, there's mines. Hmm. Oh, blowing them up. Causes the ECM error. Let's see if I can lock under those laser turrets from down here. Once my system recovers. Nope. Fortunately, I have strong defense. Hit, destroy. Give me all those nice indicators. Let me know when I've destroyed my target. Okay, let's go down this way. Get impressive traps. Whoa, look at all that. Not going that way. Uh, is this a dead end? Oh, maybe that just takes out the security. It does, that's nice. Hey, Raven, can you hear me? We got the files and we're leaving the area. Good luck. Taking out the trash. Oh, it's right here. Okay. So once I destroy this, I'm gonna want to head. Hmm. Maybe I'll just go out the way I came in. I think that's what I'll do. All oh, right, you put a bomb on it. Oh, hello. Anything on the scanners? Lewis Klein. This is God Dog. I'm in position. Oh, no, that's not Leo's plan. That's 
Let's guard dog. God dog. Preparations complete. Commence the attack. Oh man. Bomb planted. System activated. You have five minutes. Okay. Oh, is there an AC in here? Haha! He hit me a little bit, but I hit him more a bit. Mission objective achieved. Oh, piece System of cake. Switched to normal mode. New mail. From Murukumo, oh, about Murukumo Millennium. Interesting. From Nurse Concord, the Mars research record left behind by the Murukumo Millennium Corporation states that disorders are guard units created by an ancient Martian civilization. The record also indicates that the disorder units aren't acting on their own behalf. Rather, their actions are guided by some remote control tower. At this time, no such device has been located. If such a system is discovered, and the disorders could be manipulated, it would be relatively easy to conquer and control Mars. Mm -hmm. Interesting hearing about that old corporation from the first game. Let's go head to the arena and take on Rank 9 Merciless, the Black Scythe. Uh, specializing in assassinations, this pilot will mortally wound his opponents, then finish them off with his blades. He's referred to as the Grim Reaper. He's using an arms that uh, we can get that are dual laser blade. Maybe we should try him out. Uh, he's got... Oh, he has an anti-missile and then uh, the giant chain guns. Let's go to... Uh, we can go to the cave, sure. Welcome to the Cave of Doom. Oh, he's got human plus. See, did we hit him with it? I don't think we hit him with that. Oh, uh, we hit him with the little missiles. Whoa! Yeah, he wants to hit with those laser blades bad, doesn't he? This missile takes a long time to lock. It's not great. Oh, boy. Really nothing about this build is particularly good. Okay. Come on, let's lock them one more time. Okay, I'll, I'll blade duel you, dude. He gets the double blades. Oh man, it's just hard to lock this guy. That's not gonna help at all. There we go. I think we hit with like none of those. Hit him with laser blade though. I think he's out of range weapons. He's got human plus, so he's doing all kinds of like all kinds of stuff. When I connect though, I do a lot of damage.
Come on. <clears throat> he's he's definitely human plus though. He was able to fire that gun while moving. <laughs> All right. This is pretty intense. Fortunately, I do have very high defense, but it doesn't help when you just get pummeled. Haha! I got him with a really good hit there. Dude. See, he's using that chain gun. It's really doing very little damage. Here comes the trash can. Yeah, he shot it down. I think his anti-missile, or maybe his machine gun, might have even shot it down. I think you can. I think you can do that. Not the right opponent for these nukes. I uh, hit him with there. I think just barely. <laughs> Not a great loadout. I think we're gonna say bye bye to the nukes, to the trash cans. They're so heavy, we could be loading all kinds of other weapons instead. Is it, yeah, total miss there. Yes. Come on, we just wanna see the one more missile. I think it, I think it missed also. Oh, he's just wrecking us. <laughs> ah! Ah! <laughs> and yet, we have so much, so much defense. And I think if we were in the lightweight, we would have been carved up way sooner. Yeah. I'm just a big heavy guy. <laughs> I think he's shooting, and he's shooting waves out of his, yeah. Only Human Plus can do that. Whee! Well, Heavyweight is definitely slower with Overboost than Lightweight, but... Plenty fast, for sure. And that was it. <laughs> Okay, I was tempted to end the episode, but I think I want to do one more thing. I'm going to change weapons. I'll be right back. Okay, so. Uh, just change a little bit. So I've gone to the Pursuit Missiles, which are the big double back things. And a big boy bazooka. Even usable during missions, I think. With 40 rounds, not too bad. And I did have to go to a smaller booster to just barely squeeze those weapons on there. So a little silly that I had to do it that way. But, you know, I'm going to try it. Take on rank eight dreadnought in the Mark 9999. The pilot chose choose the pilot choose a caterpillar base for his AC so as to optimize its AP on offensive strength. I think I made the, they meant to say chose. His versatility in combat makes him a dangerous foe. He's got that double plasma. He's got a bazooka. He's got some pretty tough looking defense there, and he's got a little laser blade, a stabby blade. Let's go to Malaya base. So what's cool about the pursuit missiles is uh, you just shoot a pod up in the air and then it rains down a series of missiles. I didn't mean to shoot that one. You only get four shots though. Oh, he's hitting me. Yeah, we're, we're not doing great here. I'd like to try to get behind him. These boosters are really weak. Oh, I can't get close enough. Oh, 
That was bad. Well, uh, <laughs> those they're cool. Cool missiles, cool bazooka, but not gonna work there. I believe we're about to escalate all the way to DEFCON 0. Never said it would be a good build, just wanted to try it. Okay, so we're just gonna go bomb the crap out of them with missiles. Yeah, you. Let's go. Let's go somewhere maybe outside. Yeah, maybe I'm over overconfident, I don't know. Maybe not. We shall see. Nope, we're not overconfident. <laughs> Defcon wins again! This thing's just pretty unstoppable. Alright, so he starts at 9,000. Oh, we just dropped him 76. 5,800. Just hammering. Oh, it's over just so fast. <laughs> okay, not a lot left in the arena. Hopefully, we won't have to use Defcon for all of it, but we did this time. It was pretty good. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, it's time to sign off for the night. I hope you had fun. I did. And built some crap. Built some... <laughs> uh, yeah, I guess I didn't really build anything good. Uh, just had to resort to an old build here. But we'll uh, see you next time and have some more fun. We'll, we'll, I'm going to keep experimenting. <laughs>